Nick, this is the only way I could figure out how to answer your question. It's really, really hard. I can't believe I put one like this on our quiz. But like you said, you've got to use the intercept method to do this. And so in this particular problem that I have right here, if I let y equal 0, I'm sorry, I can't write, but if I let y equal 0, let me see, I might have this one written down. Yeah, it's right here. Oh, jeez. Right there. If I let y equal 0, then x has got to be equal to 2. And if I let x equal 0, then y has got to equal 1 half. That fraction is what's your problem. So the bigger problem is if both of them are fractions, but this particular one, because x is 2 when y is 0, what I'm going to do is I'm going to, first of all, enlarge my graph, and I'm going to... Sorry, I can't hold this still. Though th there's where x is 2, y is 0. I'm going to click that point. I think that was one of my points. And then the other one is x is 0, y is a half. I'm trying to get that right there, and I can't. So what I have to do is keep going over until I can see, and I'm pretty sure i got to go over 2, because for every 2 on the x-axis, I go up a half on the y-axis. So can you see now that I've caused it to cross the y-axis at 1 half? You, you cannot, like you said, you cannot get this to graph half points. So you've got to go somewhere else on the graph in order to get it to cross at half. I'm going to go ahead and do that. Then I'm going to go ahead and fill this because I know it's supposed to shade down below. And, um, and I think I got a correct answer. I hope this will help you.